Hi everybody, Craig Glendenning here, helping deep thinkers set boundaries that feel good. If you're a deep thinker, like me, you spend a lot of time in a world of ideas. All we need in order to get into flow is our journal or laptop, an empty calendar, and a window with a view. This is where our deep work happens, right? Where we build, create, develop concepts, write code, or do whatever important work we do. This is where all the high leverage work that really moves the needle for us happens. To other people, it can look like daydreaming or doing nothing. But what they can't see is that our minds are like a car with the hood open that is being worked on and all the parts are strewn out all over the place. When we do deep work, we do high quality work and we tend to be meticulous, precise, and frankly a bit OCD about the work we do. On top of this, we also tend to be very conscientious about the needs of others and feel guilty saying no when others need our time and attention. So what do we do about all of this? I use a powerful method used in the process engineering space to dig deep and get to the root cause of why setting boundaries feels so bad and to empower deep thinkers to set boundaries that feel good. Boundaries that allow you to do your best work at your peaceful and deliberate pace with no regrets and no justification. Boundaries that do not feel weird or stress you out because you feel like you have to defend them all the time. Did any of this resonate with you? If so, we might be a fit to work together. So send me a message below. Let me know what's going on. No pressure. I am not going to spam you, sell your email, or anything unethical or pushy. Let's just see if we're a good fit to do some deep work together. I know you're overwhelmed, and I hope you do reach out, because setting boundaries is really important, and feeling good about setting them is really important, too. Take care.